Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the QPR Road to Glory, where we will be taking on Manchester United at Old Trafford. We're then back at home against Man City and then away in London to Fulham. Here we are at Old Trafford. I do wonder, what are they going to do with it? Because I've heard multiple stories that they're looking to either knock down Old Trafford and build New Trafford <laughs> or just make changes to the current one and kind of renovate it. So, United fans, let me know in the comments down below or tweet me or whatever. What is the latest on that? Because for me, Old Trafford has... I mean, it's obviously one of the most historic stadiums ever. Oh, my God, what a challenge that was from Ollie Watkins. Um, I think it'd be awful if they just knocked it down. But obviously, it doesn't really bother me. I'm just... I'm surprised they would even consider that when they could just renovate it. Oh, that's not a good first touch. I guess financially, it might not make sense to renovate it for half the cost of building a new state-of-the-art stadium. It might make sense to just knock it down and start again. I do, I do understand that. It's an early corner for United here. They've got Greenwood back. Oof, not sure about that. Here is Bruno. Try and get a tackle in, but don't foul him. It's going to be another corner. Kulavale here. Let's build up down this left side. Get Giles in. Nice. Whip it. Go on. Rutter's there, but it's not quite enough. Oh, they've got Kamavinga in midfield this year. Damn. They might have signed him in this January window that just closed. Well, I say just closed, but, you know, it was the most recent one. We are actually in April now. This is good play. Diaw, this is your moment. Top scorer in the league, but he's not getting another one there. Oh, what a ball. Giles up here to Jorginho Rutter. I'm sad he had to take a touch like that. That could have been much, much better. I think we've done so well in this first half. Up against a very good United side. They might have been the better side in general. But the fact that it's still nil-nil is pretty good. Cabral's made a run here. Go on, son. Damn it. That would have been incredible. We've still got it, though. Here's Rutter. Over the top for Giles. Touch and cross. I mean, it wasn't bad, but it's not enough. Looks like we're probably going to go in at the break. Nil-nil. But that's deserved. We're in this game. <laughs> See you later, Casemiro. Oh, look at this from Mumba. He's a joke. Into Rutter now. I don't want to hit it with his right foot. I really don't. Back to Mumba. Over here to Skelly. Through ball. Oh, Zarari. No! You doggy's got it. Off me right at the last second. Well, guys, it is going to be 1-0. I'm going to get on the line. Oh, they've gone short. <sighs> Every time they get a free kick there, no matter who I'm playing against, I always worry. Good tackle. Let's go. Koulibaly, what are you doing here? That's fine. Nice. Still going? No, Kamavinga's ridiculous at that. He just nips the ball off me every single time. Jeez, Rashford. It was a good strike, but Cox is there. Let's see if we can get forward here. De Silva, he's had a very quiet game, to be fair. I'm going to take him off shortly. Giles into Zarauri. Over to Diaw. Giles has made the run. Here we go. Is this the moment? We've got Mumba far back post. I've just got no option and I've run out of steam. Oh, and Rutter's in here. Go on. Oh, he's made it. Has he got the finish? Zarauri's there. My subs haven't even got on the pitch yet. I am so, so happy I've scored. Very, very pleased. Even though it's before the subs are coming on, I wouldn't change any of them. I'm still going to go for a second goal here. Why didn't you doggy stick a foot out there? And Onana should be disappointed with that parry, whatever you want to call it. Just blocking it instead of catching it, maybe. All right, here come the subs. Let's see if we can get that second goal and kill this game off. Bruno Fernandes would be crazy to shoot from here. Yeah, he's gone for the cross, which should be fine. Win that header, Cabral. Nice. Let's get on the break. Here comes 2-0, boys. Come on. And girls, if you're watching. <laughs> Let's go. Has he got the pace on Jonathan Tarr? No, he doesn't. I can't believe that. Oh, and that would have been a foul. Rutter's quick, but I, I think he's just tired. I just think he ran out of steam towards the end of the run there. And who knows? I probably would have missed the shot anyway. <laughs> Oh, no, no, no. Not like this. I'll take that. Thank you. Have we got any space? Obviously. Because we've got Mumba in the team. He's always in space. 
Over to Doig now. Oh, he stopped his run. I think he might still get that. Yeah, he will. And then we're going to go back to Jelovic. Oh, no. It took about 20 years to get the ball under control with Doig there. But I think... I think we're good. Oh, loose ball. I rode Banan. Whoa! Two-footed challenge from Kamavinga. Get him off the pitch. <laughs> Let's pass this short and then just hit it. Jelovic. Boom! Ooh! It wasn't bad, but we've beaten Manchester United at Old Trafford, which isn't hard in real life. <laughs> Although I shouldn't say that with Arsenal still yet to go there. But what a win. Absolutely massive three points. United weren't bad, by the way. I just think I had a very good defensive performance. I did really well for once. And I took my chance. Could have maybe got a second goal. I'm so happy with that. With that loss, United dropped down into third. And we're about to take on Man City, who are now in second. Now, I have seen the odd comment, people saying that I should give Saeed a go. Should I do it? I'm, I'm going to do it. Why not? Saeed is making his debut against Man City. <laughs> and then um, Rutter can come on as a second half sub. But do you know what? Just knock it in behind. What I'll do, instructions, Saeed, stay central and then get in behind. They've still got Haaland. They've got De Bruyne in there. They've got Bakayoko on the right, Grealish on the left. No Rodri, though. And we all know that Man City without Rodri just isn't Man City. The day he leaves is a great day for everyone, non-Man City fans. <laughs> and the day that De Bruyne suddenly isn't as good as he always is, that would be nice, wouldn't it? No more De Bruyne, no more... No more Pep as well, that'd be great. I kind of miss Pep. I do like him, but he's just too good. I'm just a salty Arsenal fan at the moment. That was a hell of a tackle from Koulibaly from behind as well. No way. No way. Saeed's in already. Using the 92 pace. Hit it. Go on. No. 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 That didn't just go in. No, that didn't just happen, did it? How many touches did he take? One. Two. And then bang. He's touched the ball as a QPR player three times and he scored a bang already. I... <laughs> um, 66 rated. Furhat Saeed, remember the name. Was it Tunisia? The Tunisian Messi. <laughs> Tunisian Ronaldo, I don't know. He is suddenly in my plans now because how can I ignore that? I've got to get him more minutes somehow. I mean, he's in training. He's got a development plan. He is going to get better, of course, but... Oh, no. I need to give him minutes on the pitch so his form's high. Get a tackle in, please. Koulibaly's there again. He's just a tank, isn't he? Right, same again, yeah? Oh, and now Ferrari's in behind. Saeed, get in the box, bro. Are you ready? Go. No way. Oh, it almost worked. Doig's won it back again. Now here's Cook. No, it's Zarari, sorry. Here's Cook into Zarari. No way. Nah. <sighs> Career mode's wild, isn't it, sometimes? Like I've, I've got absolutely no reason to be starting him today other than I've got a few tired legs. But guess what? I've got Correa. I've got Elliot. He can play up front. I've thrown in a 66-rated striker, and he's got a double against Man City within 16 minutes. What is going on? It kind of feels like the game is artificially boosting his stats because he is so low-rated. It's almost like, look, Matt, you're playing against 90-rated players. Here's a, here's a little bit of help, you know? That's what it feels like. I know that's not happening. Or is it? <laughs> is there some code in the game to, to help with lower rated players in big games? Who knows? He doesn't feel like he's not good enough. Put it that way. But I haven't really had the ball with him much. It's been two chances, two shots, two goals. I haven't really given him the ball and passed it around. Oh, dear. That was poor from Ferrari. Yet yeah, theory busted because Ferrari would never have given away the ball if he was being artificially boosted. All right. Oh, my God. Oh, he was offside, but can we just take a second to admire that pass? What was that from Saeed? That was ridiculous. That was world class. I know he was offside and it doesn't matter, but the accuracy on that ball. <laughs> I feel like he's 90 rated. OK, 
careful. Please don't give away a penalty. 2-0 up right now, and I want to keep it that way. Win the header, go on. Nah, he's rubbish. Should have won the header. Oh, no. No, I can't switch to the right player. No, 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 no. Foden's in. Uh, I'm so scared of giving away penalties. And Cox, big save. No way. No. I have to go for the hat trick. I'm sorry, Ferrari. I'm sorry. It's it. He felt a little bit crippled there by the CPU. <laughs> He's quicker than that. There's no way whoever the defender was was catching up. But okay. I can't complain. I'm winning 2-0. Here's Mengi. Why have I got all my centre-backs here? I wanted to turn and shoot, but it was Koulibaly on his right. No, thank you. What a first half. That man, Saeed. Wow. Oh, oh. Go, 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 go. Into Zarari. Could it be three? I'm going to have to go over on the right side here. Oh, I've ruined it. Completely ruined it. That's all right. I get possession back. Honestly. Oh, no. No, no, no. <laughs> Don't be giving away the ball to De Bruyne there. Please, Matt. I was just going to say, though, imagine doing the double over Manchester clubs. Surely not. 2-0 right now, though. City need a goal. They need to score soon. And there it is. Wow. Bakayoko's good, isn't he? Okay. Okay. They're back in this, and it's time to make some changes. Remember, this isn't even my first team. I am going to bring in... Oh, it has to be Correa, doesn't it? I can't bring in Rutter. All right, we'll go with Correa. Um, Jelovic again. I'm a little bit worried about Koulibaly. I'm going to put Giles there and then swap in with Doig. Doig can play left centre-back. We've done it before. Giles on the left side. The fact that it's only 2-1, though, I, I'm, I'm quite happy with that. As I went 2-0 up, I, I thought, oh, it doesn't matter. City are going to score three or four against me. So the fact it's only one at the moment, I'm still quite happy with. But of course, it could change very quickly. Oh, look at the right side. Jelovic over here to Ferrari. First time pass inside to Zarari. Hasn't worked. And now I'm not going to have the ball for 20 minutes. It feels like when City get it, it's so difficult to get it back. Although, when it's in the air, I've always got a chance. There we go. Cook inside to Saeed. Definitely going to get him out of the match at this rate. Zarari. Over to Giles. Oh, I'll take that free kick. Give me the free kick. Thank you. I like how you just run into a player to get those advantages given to you. Um, what do I do here? Because I still don't have a free kick taker. I mean, Correa is my best option. I'm just going to go for it. Top left corner. Come on, Correa. Go on. Oh, it was poor. Oh, nice. Great from Cook. Zarari. Wrap the game up. Nope. Just wide. Oh, wait. I've been zoomed in on the gameplay this whole time again. Because I recorded Operation Arsenal. Wait. Let me pause it. I'm such an idiot. I'm so sorry, guys. It's an easy mistake to make. Because I open up OBS and I hit record. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god well the good news is you are still gonna see what's happened but it's just zoomed in i'm so sorry when i record operation arsenal i always zoom in on website you know fotmob or whatever i'm using on twitter and it means you can just see it a little bit better but i always forget to unzoom i'm just an idiot i'm so sorry <laughs> we've got five minutes to go here i'm just hoping we can hold on but even more so, I'm hoping we can get a third. And look at Ferrari go here. We've got Correa on the left side. That's going to work. They just brought on Rodri. Correa's got the pace on him, though. Look at that. Finish. Oh, so nearly the three points in the bag. Okay, corner coming in. It's not a bad delivery. Cannon's there just wide. Okay, that's fine. We can hang on for a few more minutes. I'm guessing we're only going to get maybe two or three minutes added on. So I'm not too concerned right now. It's three minutes added on. I just need to get the ball and hold on to it. Don't do anything stupid. No, no fouls around the box or in the box, ideally. They've only got a minute left. 
Why are they not pumping the ball forward? You're idiots. You're absolute idiots. Oh, no. Okay, the ref was meant to blow the whistle there. And now I'm going to look like an idiot if they score. Ref, this, that's ridiculous. No. What happened there with Haaland? He took about 10 years to take that shot. Edison has come up. How embarrassing. Head it out. Yes. Shoot. <laughs> We've done it. The Manchester double. Brilliant. And I'm so sorry once again that I was zoomed in. At least you still see what's going on. It just looks a bit weird. But yeah. Um, six points when I thought I'd get zero. That is massive. And now we lose to Fulham, right? I'm tempted to put Saeed in again, but he's just a bit tired now. I've just seen he's got chip shot, incisive pass and tiki taka. That's the thing with randomly generated players or regens. They just get play styles. And I'm, I'm not actually sure I like that. It doesn't really make sense, does it? You're telling me that a 66 rated player at striker with very poor passing. He's got 53 passing. He's got the incisive pass play style. It, it really doesn't make sense, does it? But um, this is the team I'm going to go with. I'm not going to make any changes here. Here is Zarauri. Over to Doig. Back to Zarauri. Has he got the finish? No, it's just wide of the post. Very, very nearly scoring in the first five minutes with our first chance as well. I was just thinking, have I have I had an episode where I've won all three games? I don't think I have. This could be the first time. I hope so, anyway. Go on, Rutter. On his right foot. Good save from Leno. What a start. We've actually made a better start in this game than the other two. And that says a lot considering we won them both. Corner comes in. Koulibaly's there. Saved by Leno again. I've just thought as well, this might be the first episode since I bought Diaw or since I signed him for free that he hasn't scored in. <laughs> That's what it feels like anyway. He hasn't scored. That's crazy. Oh, what a ball. Another save, but Mumba's there. 1-0, and we deserve that lead. My God, we are destroying this Fulham side right now. Almost half an hour in. Things have definitely settled down a little bit, but we still look very good. Diaw trying to get it through for Zorauri there. That's unlucky. By the way, I don't know what's up with the lighting at Craven Cottage. It is so contrasted. Look at the top and the bottom. It's so bright and then so dark. The lighting in this game, as you guys know, I've said it a few times, it's so broken. All right, here's Wilson. Try and stop the cross coming in. I haven't been able to, and they are going to equalise there. Cox with a weak hand again. Oh, that's Fulham's first shot, I think. Maybe second shot against the run of play. And it's one all, just like that. You're kidding me, right? They're not going to get another one, are they? No way. Oh, okay. If they scored again there, I would have been so upset. I really want the three wins from three games. I really want that. And I would love a goal for Diaw. He needs one. I can't go a whole episode without Diaw scoring. Okay, that's not allowed. Oh, Rutter. That was incredible. What a turn. And he's just powering through. Surely he's going to get the goal here. He is. Wow. I mean, I don't, I don't mind not scoring with Diaw if I'm sharing around the goals with more players. But my fear is that without Diaw scoring, that I would just not score. And that's not the case because Rutt has come in, obviously done a great job. Mumba's got another goal today. And there is always De Silva. And um, who else has been, who's been scoring a lot of my other goals? Zarawi's had a few. Um, oh, I'll take that quickly. Who else? Giles, did he get one recently? I think he did. So we, we've got a goal. We've got goals every... Oh, we're in. De Silva. And that should be enough, right? It is 3-1 as we go in at the break. I thought that might work. Look at that. I made a little run with Diaw there. Oh, let me through. Nice. <laughs> He's onside. Is this going to be the Diaw goal? Still going here? No way. <laughs> How did he lose so much pace? Again, like this happened against... Was it Man City when uh, I had... It was Man City because Saeed made, it, made his debut there. But he was just all of a sudden not very quick when I'm through on goal. The game just knows, doesn't it? Oh, what a ball. No, and again, I, I want this Diaw goal. Diaw, where are you? Why are you here? Why? Get in. 
Oh, no, it's not going to work. I'm just not going to get it, am I? I'm 3-1 up, though. I can I can just force it, right? I can just try. This is the one. Okay, Diaw's going to get a goal here. Okay, no, he's not. Because Skelly's the one that's in loads of space. Oh, my God. And I've missed it. How? I, I don't know. Right, Diaw. He's coming short. He'll be on his left foot, though, if I turn. And now we got on his right. No. That's fine. We've got it back again. No. <laughs> I'm trying too hard. I'm 3-1 up, though. I can afford to just, just try and get Diaw his goal. But does it really matter? No. I think he's still top scorer in the league, so I, I really shouldn't be worried. But I'm going to give it a few more goes here because we've still got time. And maybe he can get in a good bit of space. That is so unfortunate. Damn it, Wobi in the way. Come on, win it back. We're going to go into injury time here, and that is going to be, what, two minutes maybe? One. Oh, this is it, though. Okay, well, Rutter's going to have to be the one that has the shot. It's a good save from Leno. I'm actually quite happy it's a corner because maybe Diaw can get on the end of this. It is Diaw. No! He's actually scored a few headers in, in similar areas this season, so that's just unfortunate. But what a way to finish the episode. A win at Old Trafford, a win against City at home, and then a win at our rivals Fulham as well. Three wins in three games. I'm not sure I've done that before. Maybe I have, but I'm so happy with that. And I'll see you in the next episode. Again, sorry for recording zoomed in. It's my bad.